12-year-old girl. She is fighting for her right to play football. Madison Baxter and her parents have started a campaign on Facebook after she was kicked off the team at her private school. The school says it's worried about how the boys on the team might react, even though Madison and those same boys have played together for years. NBC's John Muller has the story. This morning, there is growing controversy over a 12-year-old Georgia girl's fight to play football. My mom counts it that I had five sacks. I counted as four. The entire crowd thought it was one of their boys. And when they saw my number and looked at the roster, they saw it was me standing ovation right there. Maddie Baxter was the starting defensive tackle for Strong Rock Christian School's sixth grade team. But now the rising seventh grader school has told her that she's not allowed to play next year. The reason? She's a girl. It's taking that fun that I had for a year and then just snatching it right out from under me. In a statement to news media, Strong Rock Christian School said middle school girls play girls sports and middle school boys play boys sports. Maddie's mother, Cassie Blythe, tells ABC News the CEO of the school said boys have lustful thoughts and might think of Maddie in an impure way. I think it's very archaic and he needs to get with the times. Maddie and her mother have started a Facebook campaign called Let Her Play. The page has already gotten over 25,000 likes and received hundreds of supportive comments. One person writing, Maddie, you are such a bright young lady. We are all behind you 100 percent and people should be limited by ability, not gender. It was her dream to get a scholarship one day, be one of the first female football players in college. Like she really had big dreams. If the school does not have a change of heart, Maddie will play in a recreational league next year. She may also transfer to a different school so she can play the game she loves so much. For Good Morning America, John Muller, ABC News, New York.